Major Slack Attack. Hey, welcome back to Major Slack Attack, your first stop for titillating tactical Elden Ring gameplay, and we are off on another mission to get yet another bell bearing, the somber smithing stone miner's bell bearing 2, which will allow us to buy infinite somber smithing stones 3 and 4. What about 1 and 2? 1 and 2 you can buy infinitely from EG. Right here. Smithing Master EG. So, um, as long as he's alive, um, you can buy infinite 1 and 2. Somber smithing stones 1 and 2 from him. Um, yeah. I went off, off camera. I l went to the ATA, made a little withdrawal, and now I can level up. Let's level up. Put more, yet more points into endurance to, to bump up our equipment load. Done and done. And I want everybody to swap out their blood ounce fang for the morning star. It's all you, morning star. It's all you. It's all me. It's all you. Yeah, it's all you for the next little run here. And hopefully, you got your tower shield, and um, that's it. You just spend every last bit of money here. We are going to Altus Tunnel. Ah, always a pleasure. Goodbye. Okay, emptying out the wallet. We are going to Altus Tunnel. Altus Tunnel is right here. Okay, right there. Now you would think this would be the closest. But it, to get to it, but this is a humongous cliff, like a very high cliff. You never get off it. Um, basically, this is a pain in the arse. You got to start here, Altus Highway Junction, and you're gonna go north. Once you hit the map pillar, like the pillar, you know where you get the map. Um, you're gonna push off over this way, towards the Second Church of America. Okay, basically you gotta go off this cliff here, jump down here, jump down here, go along here, jump off this cliff and jump down here. It's the only way to get down. It's a real pain in the arse. And then go along here, and then you're gonna meet all these like these death blight, I forget I forget what they're called, but these things that can like apply the death blight to you, and if your death blight meter fills up completely, you like die. <laughs> Instantly, I'm not talking about like a slow death like poison. I mean you die instantly. So these things are Extremely dangerous and then we're gonna go around here and come down there. All right, so that's the plan. Let's do it All right push north by the way, we're going to pick up a free rune arc, so all, all, those of you who burned through all your rune arcs, you're about to get one. Protect it with your life. Okay, this is what I call the map pillar. This is where you first pick up the map for the area, alright? At this point, you want to push northwest. This is a safe drop down. Keep pushing northwest towards the tr Second Church of America. This is another safe drop down. And you might want to kill these doggies just to kind of like give yourself a chance to look around for another safe place to drop down on that cliff over there. Bring it, doggy. Thank you. Okay, you're going along here. And you see here, here's the safe place to drop down. And you can hear those, I don't know what they're, what they're called, but they're laughing away. It's really creepy. 
Okay, you probably want to go over there. Oh wait, got a doggy here. <laughs> um, he's protecting. What is that thing? It's, um, uh, I forget what it is. I was wondering if you could do these guys in with the. I don't think the longbow is going to do that much. Oh, now I remember what it is. It's um, it's a Michaela's lily. That's enough out of you. All right. That should be a safe drop down. And dislike all of it, dislike all of it. Okay, so now it's just a matter of following along here. And there's going to be a teardrop scare with a trio of these. Um, I don't know the name of them, but that thing that we just killed that spits death blight. Um, the teardrop scarab. has a somber smithing stone 5 so let's just follow the click here we go here we go probably the best thing to do there's a um, a side of grace just opposite probably the best thing to do is ride around to the side of grace Activate that first and then work from there. In case you blow it and the teardrop scare runs away. Then you just go back to the side of grace, reactivate it, try again. Okay, so here we go. Activate this baby right here. Okay, so we want to take down, take down this teardrop scarab as quickly as possible. So we're going to buff up with everything. Get our sneak on. Because we can't afford to be dealing with these guys. I have taken him down with the Bloodhound's Fang, but it's, it's, it's freaking dangerous. Because like I said, when that death bite meter fills up, you're dead. Okay. Golden Vow, Flask of Wondrous Physic, Longbow, Aim, Mighty Shot. Gonna have to do it twice. Got it. Here we go, Somber Smithy Stone Fight. And let's get the, the hell out of dodge. Job well done. Job well done. Okay, next. Altus Tunnel. There's another one of those death blade thingies. Um, let's just blow right past him. Just past the golden room. It's not worth it. Okay, and go straight for our beacon. Here's what we're looking for these rooms right here. It's creepy as hell, eh? Like. 
death blooded me a tarnish today. You too? Yeah, me too. <laughs> Alright, Altus Tunnel. This is uh, one of the few tunnels that has no secret on the way down the elevator. It's just like an empty space. Let me just check this out again. That doesn't appear to be anything. I'm going to jump off just in case. Nothing here. Invisible walls. Hey, cheap ass mine elevator, no secret. It's like a soccer play. Not that I could see. Okay, it's all Morning Star and the Longbow. Even for the boss fight at the end. Um, for now, we can do without this. Put that on. Whoops. Six to six is a little extreme. We don't need that much health. Um, let's go with um, let's go a little FP heavy. Let's go with eight and four. Uh, one of those marionette guys that we can one shot. Well, we can harass him. Let me just take uh, this guy out of the roll here. Basically, mighty shot, headshot, and run away. Morning Star guard counter. That's enough out of you. This guy we should be able to backstab. Let's just make sure that nobody's waiting to ambush us around there. No, okay. Not backstab, but rather just charge attack, one shot, and that's all they and we are here to collect a whole bunch of smithing stones. Five. There's your rune arc. Guard it with your life, people. Wandered into the wrong place at the wrong time. Okay, we got a whole bunch of crystallian snails here. When they're in this uh, state here, best thing is you just one shot them with the longbow mighty shot. You 
could go and melee them, but you know, then it, could, it can occasionally turn into a total clusterfuck. Okay, and this guy's just around the corner. You know what happens when people around the corner. A little gravitus attack. Lock on. And that's all she wrote. Love me my gravitus. And get some crystal darts and a whole bunch of cracked crystal. Plundered and pillaged. You're done? You're done. Okay, we got another one of these marionette guys here. We're just short of one-shotting them with a headshot. I'm wondering if um, they cast Golden Vow just before. Switch over to the bow. Nope. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, so it's not worth it. Here's another one. That's enough out of you. Okay, three miners. Minding their own business. Ha ha ha. Another smithing stone five. Okay, we got some activity here. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, who's shooting that glowstone crap at me? It's around the corner there, I see. Show yourself, come on. I see you, there you are. Swing and a miss. Gotcha. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Uh oh. Gotcha. <laughs> so many miners to whack. Oh, the choices. Okay. Another smithing stone five. Excellent.
heavy button slack? Yes. Yes, I am. Oh, here we go. Oh. Okay, let's see with this guy first. Watch it out. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect landing <laughs> for me. <laughs> Guess we could take cover right here. Uh, did you miss me? Dude. And again. No, no, you don't. And again. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, calm down there, Bullseye. He's dead. Here we go. Alright, this is done. like this big giant gigantic best thing to do is take it out with the longbow but you got to do it kind of like a peekaboo strategy here as soon as you target it's going to get activated you can't just like sneak out it's like the game like you know see game totally cheats totally cheats okay so we got to pop out and um in between shots. This is a good time to buff up with the Golden Vow. That's the best way to do it. Pop out, aim, mighty shot, and immediately go back in. That crap is finished shooting, do it again. That'll hurt you. Oh, swing and a miss. You're done for this time. That's what I'm talking about. That'll pay 5,000 runes. Cha ching. 5,760. Okay, so we got a little bit of uh, platforming to do here. Gold. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Fumble Fingers. Oh shit! Forgot about that guy. These crystal snails are a force to be reckoned with. You gonna come around the corner? A little more.
Okay, here we go. Yep. Okay, let's go up to the top first. That is going to be very useful. An upgrade to our arsenal charm. Add an extra pound and a half to our luggage capacity. Equip that right away. something I missed. No, it's just one level. Up there, <clears throat> this is actually access from another location actually, another dungeon. So don't think you can get up there through here. It's another dungeon. Uh, we may be doing that later. Okay, so that's it. Let me just double check here. See, I feel like I forgot something. Got the Golden Rune 7. Yeah, I think we got it all. Alright. That's all done. Okay, for good. <clears throat> well, watch now. Okay, we got a whole bunch of these like crystal snails here once again. You know the routine. One shot them with the longbow. In their dormant state. And don't forget one final smithing still behind here. Alright. Great. Alright, here's the boss fight. It's two of these crystalline things, just like the one you faced in the rail the the Ray Lucario crystal tunnel. Is that what it's called? Yeah. The one where we got the, the smithing stone miners bell bearing one, the Ray Lucario crystal tunnel. Let me just check the map here and I'll. That one right there. Okay? That had a boss crystallion. This time there's two of them. However, with Pumpkin Head and our shield, these guys are going to be a cakewalk. Um, here's how to set up for this. Let me just check my notes. Yeah, first of all, we're going to put on the guard counter talisman, this one right here, the curved sword talisman, it has its guard counters. Uh, next, we want to put on the cerulean amber medallion, so we have enough FP to cast pumpkin head. See, now our max FP is 112, that's good. Then, we're going to use our flask of winter's physic, the golden vow buff. 
Um, let's switch. Okay, so quality morning star, Rajas Rapier with the Golden Vow. And Demi Human Queen Staff in the right hand this time because we're going to use the Scholar's Shield spell. That's it. Okay, so refill our health. Okay, so. Flask of Wonders Physic with Strength and Dexterity in a Golden Vow, Scholar Shield, Refill FP, Enter, Cast Pumpkin Head, Refill FP, and then just basically go after whichever Crystallion Pumpkin Head does not go after. Then all you're going to do is block, and as soon as it hits you, press Strong Attack to get a Guard Counter, and Rinse Repeat, and they're going to go down really fast. They're gonna, you're going to break their poise really, maybe like two or three Guard Counters, and it, its poise is going to be broken, then do a critical hit, and then finish it off with a, with a charge attack. It's pretty much a no-brainer. Alright, so that's it. You got your standing orders? Let's do it. Go for a pumpkin head. Dealer's choice. Great, he's going after the ring one first, okay? Well, you just have to get behind her and you get a critical hit and that's it that's all she wrote real easy there we go somber oh that's what it's called the somber stone minor bells bear <laughs> once again what a mouthful the somber stone miners bell bearing two ours done and done that was pretty much textbook. And it looks like we're close to leveling up again. Let's just take this, uh, oh, there's some jellyfish out here now. Okay, um, nice jellyfish. Who's a good jellyfish? Ah, that girl. Okay, um, <laughs> Back to the round table, we'll turn this in. And it looks like I'm just short of leveling up again, so I'm going to hit up the ATM. And this time I'm going to put points into Vigor. Okay, so we can... Done enough leveling of Endurance for now. Back to leveling up Vigor. Alright? Okay, so the shop is getting very well stocked. We can now buy Somber Smithing Stone 3 and 4. And Cracked Crystal. Did they get another Rune Arc? Or did I just... I thought I bought them all. Could have swore I bought them all. Well, I'm buying that one as soon as I got the money. Yeah, can't get enough Rune Arcs. I burned through a lot of those in practice runs. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so everybody's got themselves a rune arc. Like I said, guard it with your life. 
And I'm going to call it. Thanks a lot for watching. And if you thought this was remotely entertaining and or informative, you know what to do. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe, post a comment, tell your friends about my channel. And I'll see you next time for some more Elden Ring. Hey guys, real walkthroughs like these are an endangered species here on YouTube. For a complete lowdown on the YouTube video game walkthrough scene, check out my Patreon page and please consider making a donation to yours truly, Major Slack, to help keep real walkthroughs alive on YouTube. You can donate as little as $1. That's $1, that's all. That's all it takes, alright? Thanks a lot, really appreciate it.